You're really concentrating to stay there, aren't you? Mm -hmm. Do you think you'd be able to do that concentration if you were drinking? Not at all. Students at Hampshire High School struggled to stay on the road recently when they sat behind the wheel of a simulator that allows the driver to experience what it's like to operate a vehicle while impaired by alcohol. I'm Greg Larry, reporting for HampshireReview.com. The Alcohol Beverage Control Administration, or ABCA, based in Charleston, brought a trailer to the school containing a driving simulator last Thursday and Friday, April 7th and 8th. The simulator educates students on the hazards of driving under the influence by letting them feel the difficulties that come with operating a vehicle with an elevated blood alcohol content. You'll feel the steering change in the curve. I'm a little drunk right now. <laughs> the simulator emulates the blurring of vision and sluggish reactions by causing the brakes and steering to imitate the lack of control experienced by an inebriated person. Beginning with a .02 blood alcohol content and slowly raising it up to .08, which is the level all 50 states consider as DUI, or driving under the influence, the driver of the simulator can experience firsthand how difficult and dangerous it can make driving. It's going to take longer to slow down. Now you're at 0-4, that's your BAC. The simulator's making changes to the steering and the braking. Now, how much concentration are you having to use to stay in that lane? A lot. Do you think you'd be able to do that if you were drinking and driving? Probably not. <laughs> With its 3D graphics, rear view and side mirrors, and wide field for peripheral vision, the simulator offers a realistic experience for the driver. Student Andriana Haynes was trying to keep the wheel under control here while facing the challenges created as blood alcohol content increases. How difficult was that? That was horrible. <laughs> Valued at $90,000, the simulator was obtained by the ABCA through a grant from State Farm Insurance, along with funds from the Governor's Highway Safety Program. The ABCA hopes the program will educate students on the risks involved in driving under the influence, which run from a criminal record, loss of license, difficulty obtaining insurance, and destruction of property, to the devastation of injuries and fatalities. I'm with Andriana Haynes. Andriana just came out of the simulator. Andriana, what did you learn from your experience today? Um, people should not drive drunk. It's extremely dangerous and they just shouldn't do it at all. What was your experience as your blood alcohol content increased while you were behind the wheel? What was that like? Um, it was really hard. The higher my blood alcohol content went up, the harder it was to do anything and the more things I hit.